Bishop goes, yeah, he, he got some sick beats. He might not have been the best president ever, but he definitely knows how to make some sick beats. Those bars? Damn, out of, out of, out of this world. Kanye and shit. <laughs> Just joking, of course. Flowers, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. So, I'm back. Thank you guys very much for what for waiting. Let's, uh, let's, I guess let's get back to Skyrim. We still have, I think, one or two caves to clean out before we're gonna get to that uh, readout with one of the Forsworns, and then we're possibly gonna return that reward to, um, in Markarth. After which, I will uh, get back to Morthal, and we're gonna do the side quest over there. Let's get, let's get going. First, let's launch the game. I got myself some warm tea. Uh, actually, way too warm for me right now. Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? Go back to the chess club. Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? Yes, I was in the chess club. Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? I'm gonna make video game. Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? level 115 holy crap very close to 116 if i'm gonna reach 116 today that would be nice i genuinely doubt that i'm gonna reach level 120 anytime soon but who knows maybe who knows uh okay so we have the second cave right in front someone tells me that the second cave is actually covered by dwemerland but we'll see this cave also might be way way above me when it comes to the entrance to it but uh yeah it must be above me i think it's time to skyrim horse my way over there oh it's actually not really berlin berlin discovered well, that might only that might mean that we have uh, some kind of underground city, but I'm not really sure. Let's get inside, shall we? Looks familiar. Oh, bear. Um. That might actually give me the soldier that I want. Yeah, knowing life, I'm gonna leave this place with a bomb break fever. Wait. Bear land. <laughs> I think I get it. I don't know who created those places, but... Oh boy. Somebody knew exactly what he was going for. Dwemerland, Bearland, there's gonna be a Draugrland. Nazim land, when the only thing that you get inside is just a bunch of Nazims telling that they were in the Cloud District and how often they're visiting it. I can see that happening. Also, uh, I need to recast Muffle. And I also need to take a Flame Atronach. The Uncle Land, when you only see Uncle Landers and you immediately leave because it's so boring, right? <laughs> yeah, let me get the Fire Breath. Uh, let me get the swords. Is there something over there? Doesn't look like it. Yo! There goes the greater soul.
at least, I'm gonna be honest, I'm able to fill my soul gems and I'm really happy about it. Uh-oh. Let me guess. Failed. Yep, that's all the greater souls that I have. Fair enough. Switch to regular weaponry. Ah, uh, then I want to pick the bear carcass. Well, according to the game, this was it. Silver necklace. Sure, why not? Like, okay, honestly, don't tell me that this is it, because I'm gonna be the kind of disappointed, and I'm gonna consider this dungeon to be very, very, very pointless. Like, no joke. This is it? Okay, I get it. This, this is, um... This is basically a joke place. This is basically a joke place. Well... Good to know that. Yeah, let's just go for my targeted cave and, uh, move on. Save myself a little bit of embarrassment. Bear land. Not much of a bear land, if I, if I could be honest. Okay. Forgotten readouts. I know there are gonna be Forsworn inside, so I'm gonna switch the weapons. And already, and I don't have any black soul gems, so yeah. Forgotten readout. Well, hello there, lady. I should actually bring the Frost Breath and the Snow Dancer. No, she's actually a little bit too strong. Snow Atronach. Then again, who knows? It might be the only force one in the entire zone. We need to find a way to open that door. Hello to you. How are you doing? Mr. Luder? Oh, sorry, Miko. You're always getting in the way, though. Yeah, gold ingots. Let's pick up that. Ooh. Ooh, nature card. Just lying on the table, you know, just waiting to be picked. Bear land. Jesus Christ. I understand that it's a joke in dungeon, but still. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Get a raw beef. It seems like this area have been filled with. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Level one versus level one hundred and fifteen. Hey, that's Shrine of Talos. I can refresh my blessing. Which I prefer over every single other blessing currently. New land land. Yes. Basically the same. But different. But still the same. Is someone there? 
Nope, not me. Now you're mine. Phew, poor sod. Oh, damn. Okay. Fall. Okay, finding some high level enemies. It's manual of arms. Don't need that. There's no gods, there's only Borg. Yeah, that's right. You cannot best me. The new one has a tree on it? Poggers. Totally something unique. Something that no other land has. 100%. You can make a DLC out of it. Let me get that. Human heart. Okay, time to dig up some more. I actually might give it to some uh, to one of the companions. You are carrying too much to be able to run. Well, Danelin. Danelin. My backpack with personality. Come here. Are we heading out? Uh, we're actually heading in. Uh, trade some things. All right, let's trade. Yes. So we got Force One and Nordic, and thank God you're actually constantly switching to the Dragon Bone Arrows. God bless you for that. Okay, so... Bear pelt. Cave bears, deer, ebony, elk, frost, gold, iron, saber, silver, winter, and wolf. Yep, that should do for now. At least I hope I will be able to clean up this dungeon before I'm gonna do something else. Yeah. Because he got personality, and I actually enjoy it. I quite enjoy Will personality, and also a side quest that he gives me immediately the moment you meet him. Hmm. This place seems rather empty. Well, don't mind me, I'm just gonna steal all your shite. I didn't want to pick up the knife, but uh, I can return that to you. There we go. I can definitely hear some knocking in the background. That no- ooh! <laughs> well, well, well. Don't mind if I do. All those precious alchemy ingredients. All them salty salts. Moon sugar. Hmm. 
It seems like I need to recast the muffle in my snow atronach. Let's do that really quick. Mm-hmm. They have an iron ore over here. Entire iron mine, to be quite honest. Yep, that mage needs to go down first. Oh, what the fuck are you run- Stop moving! You twig. Finally, thank you. Let's dig up the rest of this place. Can you stop? And the funny thing is, I set up their spawn to 25% and they're still spawning every single time. So I think I need to like set up their spawn to like only be like maybe 5% for the beginning of the game. So the moment they're spawning, it's actually more rewarding, more than anything, I think. Sounds like a good idea, at least on the paper. Shrooms, all the shrooms. Do they have anything on the t uh, is that a, yeah, that's just a piece of ground, I, it seems. Nothing here, that's a potent potion of health. Uh, restores 11 points of health. How many potions I have here? Two. Um, okay, I'm gonna take this one as a third. Sure, why not? And that's a frostbite venom, which I'm gonna use later to probably combine it with other poisons, if something's gonna allow me to do that. I'm gonna take uh, this, because it's super expensive. And raw venison. Fucking raw! Master Lock. Oh boy. Let me guess. Bruh. This chest is totally not gonna end in absolute disappointment. Bruh. Like, we are totally not gonna get disappointed by opening this. Nice. Okay, I'm kinda disappointed. That's a weak potion of feather. It's not really gonna help me. <laughs> Mm, meteor shower? That actually seems like something that Serana could use. I'm just gonna try to teach her that. Hmm. But then again, knowing life, she's gonna try she's going to try to constantly cast it, even though it's just the interior cell. Yeah. I consider that uh, to be a possibility. Hello! Huh? Two harbingers. No, I can do better. Dead. Well, technically bounty complete. We just need to get our reward for it. Human flesh. Yep, yep, yep. All the goodest goodies. Come to daddy. 
Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, soul gems, sure. I mean, there's like so many animals that I can um, totally capture. Mm hmm. Yep. Yep. Soul gems for days. Can't see why anyone would want to live in a cave. Sure, they're fun to explore, but after a while, you'll start to miss the sun. Just be a hermit, easy. Uh, dwarven crossbow fire, tempted, but I'm not gonna take it. Ebony hammer, not good. Uh, Einhart, no. Forsworn. Circlet seems actually pretty nice. Oh, look, another soul gem. Hmm. Painting of certain value. Uh, another scroll. Silver ingot. And wicked scimitar. No, thank you. Mm hmm. Let's just use this instead. I wouldn't be surprised if this was not the end of the entire dungeon. But then again, I see this and I know it is. Well, it was a nice and polite little dungeon. Nothing too outstanding. But also nothing that is harm uh, harmful, so. Yeah. It's good. But yeah, now that I have a bunch of smaller soul gems, we need to switch our weapons, starting with bow, sword, and two-hander. Well, and just as I predicted, now we need to get back all the way to the bridge, and then get back to Markarth. So we can get our reward, and also in Markarth, we can sell some of the items, so it's a win-win situation. Eggs. Actually, as a matter of fact, I'm going to recast my bow right now. Well, that was a trip. I think it took us like three days in-game. To be able to basically get everything that uh, get to this location. Oh, two septims, and there's a journal, swimmer's journal. Father wouldn't like if I caught me swimming out of here again, but I just can't help myself. Horseman said, "Yep, he dead. He dead. Yep, there's even some blood over here. He freaking dead." Ah, uh, that's an assassin. That's all you got. I don't have any black soul gems though. Yeah, it was quite the traveling, especially back and forth. I don't have any black soul gems. Sag. Yep, that's another Brotherhood assassin right there. I guess they have a boring life, if they are tending to do this all the time. Yeah, I also like traveling. Uh, this is why I'm not using fast traveling at all. Because it's uh, there's like way too many opportunities to either capture a soul, encounter a dragon, get a random encounter. It's just... You know, there's too much to do right now that I have the mod for the encounters. If I'm gonna find a mud crab, I'm definitely gonna try to capture its soul. I don't even know if I have petty soul gems, but uh, I guess finding a mud crab would would uh, give me an answer quite rapidly. I think that's Carveston over there. No, not really. It's not really a Carveston. It's some kind of a different little baby house, whatever that is. Ooh, eggies.
Yeah, we're not going this way. We're gonna get the bag that we came. So first through here, then we're gonna reach the camp. And from the camp, we're gonna go probably up. There should be a path over there. Wait, do I have that achievement from Conjuration? Hold up, let me check something. Um, wrong, 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 wrong. A destruction Conjuration. Soul Reaper. After trapping 250 souls, old band weapon perks twice as long. Okay. That's perks that are lasting twice as long, not the weapons. Yep, yeah, I see a mudcard right there. And somehow that missed. Pepe game. There we go. First try. First try. <laughs> Even Daniel was like, yo, man, let, let me teach you some archery. <laughs> yo, dog, we, we heard like, like missing arrows, so we <laughs> we'll give you this point in archery right now. I hope you don't mind. Yes. But yes, indeed, I don't. <laughs> Um, yeah, because regular Nindroot does not really have that big of a value to me. I also know where Nindroot constantly grows up, so... Yeah. Also, the only Nindroot that I am remotely interested in is Crimson. Because there is a quest for Crimson Nindroots. Excuse me. Ah, my nose was super itchy. No, Miko. Yeah, but Crimson Ninruts are making even better noises. You guys gonna think? Uh, you gonna? You guys gonna see later? In the me oh my goodness! God damn it, Miko! Yeah, just let just you know, lay on the ore that I need to dig what out. You need? No, Jesus! All right, let's trade. Sometimes my companions are just driving me nuts. These nuts, ha, huh? got him. Um, anyhow, we'll just give a, a, a someone to you. Oh, you cannot carry anymore. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair enough, my dude. Okay, so this is the cave over there. That means the uh, pathway to to the fortress is somewhere close. Is that a frogger? No, that's just a corundum guardian. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, I don't. I have the map marker for that. <laughs> I have a mod that gives me map markers for this, so I'm, I'm good. I'm good. And I don't mind having a lot of uh, map markers. Because it actually helps me a lot. Mm, highway somebody, yeah? Hey, Majestic. Fall. Yeah, highway man. Kill my god, Andrew. You, you suck at archery. Get your, get your aimbot, you fucking loser. Yeah. I don't like the speed. That's your best? Huh? Get <laughs> You're clear. <laughs> The funny thing is, I can still use my Dragonbone arrows with my bound weapon. I am not forced to use the Daedric arrows that are coming with this weapon.
Okay, so that's the horse, and I need to get to Markov. Carverston is over there, but Carverston does not really have anything of interest to me. Like, it doesn't have a trader, it is only a mining village location, place thingy. And that's the best used out of that place, sadly. Rip Adventure Leader. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh, hi, Mark. Hey, Whiskey. No, I didn't done DLCs. I didn't even touch the main quest. Like, the only part of the main quest that I have touched is just that I unlocked the dragons. I first want to deal with the Hellfire DLC, because it is technically the most boring... You know, it's technically the most boring stuff, so the moment I'm gonna deal with that, I'm pretty much gonna consider that my prep stage for the game is done and I will move into factions, then main quests, then DLCs, and then custom quests. That is the plan that I have assumed and I'm gonna and I'm gonna keep with that. Yep, yeah, sounds spicy and organized the way I like it. Okay, so if I want to go to the Markarth, I need to turn... I could just go straight forward because, uh, yeah, sure. It brings no difference which, which path I'm gonna take. What makes a difference is that I need to recast my Muffle. And I also need to recast my Atronach. Everything's in order? I I hope. I know that there's a general trader inside Markarth, so I'm actually happy about that. But yeah, dealing with her fired her fire DLC, it's like it is kind of painful, because you have to do a lot of things for cities. But then, the moment it passes, the moment you basically deal with like, three to four weeks of this, the game is just flows down, everything just goes. At least as far as to my memory, as far as to my knowledge. How has been the fishing? Bro, the best Did DLC ever. A best de best DLC, I the best mod that I don't have. Because I have a minimum of self-respect, thank you very much. <laughs> Let me drink some tea. Mm. Bro, what what are you attacking now? What is that creature even doing here? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a mechanical... What is a mechanical dragon doing here? I mean, he's just level 5, but still. You should not exist. You should not attack the town. What a bloody fuckity fuck! Welcome to Marker Population. Uh, well, what is happening right now? He's gonna die soon, though. Can he even land? Oh, yes, he can. Right, he's right next to the mine. It's 
really dead then? I hope it is. It may be dead now. Where did it come from? <laughs> Hi, Miko. <laughs> uh, okay. Give me that. What is even, like, going on? I mean, sure, I'm gonna accept the Dragon Soul, but still. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here all weekend. I'm gonna give autographs while I'm gonna be exiting this place. Uh, yeah, that's a general store. Did you hear it's all a that noise outside? <laughs> it's just the market rabble. We should get back to work. Yeah, it's just the market you rabble. If you're here today, <laughs> step up to the counter. <laughs> it's just a market rubble. Nothing no, special. I'm not Arnleaf. Yes, I know it's called Arnleaf and Sons. Damn. Um, let me see what we got for sale. Take a look. Gladly. Okay, let me see what I can sell to you first. Um, uh, that's a burn circle 49 points, so this is better than this, even though it's a hell drain, but. It's not gonna work against the thing that I want it to work. So, next weapon that I can sell to you, I see the Icy Spear thingy. Already 4,700, so with this I'm gonna definitely be able to buy a house in Morthal. Ebony and Daedric, yes please. Let's see what else. That's a sure grip. I'm actually gonna keep it for, whoever, for what other companion I'm gonna have. And mm, this eminent and sure, I'm gonna sell the sure one. Uh, it's a payload bandolier that's gonna go for somebody else. Let's see, Stalkrim boots. No, that's Markarth. I'm not gonna. I'm not touching the quest for Markarth unless I have a specific quest to do in Markarth. Like if one of the main objectives is gonna force me to go to Markarth, then I'm gonna partake in doing every single other side quest, sure, but I'm not doing them right now. I have a system that just works, just like this game, yes, 100%. I'm only here to deliver the bounty and just move back to uh, Morthal, that's the only thing that interests me. Yeah, I don't need the small bones. The rest of them uh, can be scrapped. Okay, it seems like uh, this is all that I can truly sell. Thank you. Come back whenever you need something. I truly did not expect it to get a dragon. Even better, get a such a low level mechanical dragon at level five. Level 5? I wish that was Mulinir when I initially started the game. But no. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? Yeah, I guess I'm infamous with Talmor. Okay, I know what's their what's their deal, but it's quite clear that they don't really like me. Or some... Yeah, thanks! Don't have to fight them here. They Bitch, really I them just them. killed your bodyguards. You, of all people. Yes, me! Mm -hmm. 
deal with it. I don't know why though these two have like attacked me out of nowhere, but I'm definitely not very popular with Tharmar, that's for sure. I guess my reputation precedes me a little bit. I'm Igman's uncle as well as his steward. Uh leader for Garden Readout Money. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. 350. Oh boy. I have letters to read. Yes, I bet you do. Um Alright, so. We've done all the bounties. I am quite I have quite a lot of items here. So what I think is gonna happen is that instead of going all the way back to my home, because I'm gonna have to go there anyway, I'm gonna use Dimension Door. I'm gonna sort all my entire inventory. And after that, we're gonna go to Morthal and we're gonna start doing the side quest over there. I mean, at this point, it's uh, pretty much a case of death to all Thalmor, because they are being assholes. They are trying to kill me for no very good reason. Yes. So yes, they are going to die. Ah, perfect. Well, almost, but still. We've stopped. What is it? Uh, okay, my house. There we go. Okay, let's start resorting. Let's see. What do we get here? Uh, yeah, I don't need this. I don't need this. I do not need this. Arkish bow. Steel. From armors, let's see. I see the jewelry, orcish stuff of these stuffs, ritual of Boethia armor, which I'm also not gonna wear. That's a forgotten magic. I need to drop the forgotten magic and to here. What I still remember. And also, you need? I need to take a look in your inventory, as you Gladly. are also carrying things. There we go. When they are not assholes, um, rarely. Very rarely, I think. Almost never, comes to think about it. Like, they always like to put their nose into somebody's business, as it is during the main quest, when you try to strike the deal with, uh, between the Stormcloaks and the Imperials. Like, they very like to put up their noses into, into not their things, like, it's, ooh. They just want to do everything to gain that little bit of a control. Fucking assholes. But thankfully, you can tell them to just piss off and you are good to go, so... <laughs> hey! Mmm... Pistcarp, yes. Alright, so it's from the things that I already pre-crafted that I'm gonna leave for later. I see a plenty. Not gonna lie, I see a plenty. Here we go. Uh, also see some potions that I need to leave behind. Frostbite Venom and Troll's Blood. It's a consummate blood potion. Do I have any small potions of like... Weak potion of health. I can give that to somebody else as well. Okay, so that was all the like jewelry and stuff, so now I need to leave. Oh, yeah. Uh, before I'm gonna do that, cooking. I know I have a plenty of raw beef. 
and plenty of fat to create animal tallow, tallow, which is needed for building stuff. Raw hominid? Uh, I don't even remember when I picked it up, but apparently I did. I'm gonna have to check it out. Hold up. Jugs of water, hominid flesh. Yeah, because the alchemy um, overhaul is automatically changing the human flesh that is a alchemy ingredient into food ingredient. Which makes no sense to me at all. This is why I'm gonna eliminate that mod from future playthroughs. Right now it's too late to do that, sadly. But, uh, yeah. We'll manage to deal with that in our own time. Okay, so common soldier ingot, flawless stuff, more ingots, one soldier, two soldier, more ingots, even more soldier, silver, and that's troll skull, superb animal bones, and other animal bones are gonna go for other thingamajigs. Um, right, so here comes the food that I don't need, at least not for now. Brilliant, and now from the items that I'm don't, not gonna need. Yeah, uh, you live, you learn. Exactly. That's uh, that's how I approach this. At this point. As people say, nothing ventured, nothing nothing gained, and in this case, I only gained additional knowledge about which mods I want which things I want to really manipulate with, you know, that kind of, that kind of stuff. Um, and I think this is it. The other items... I don't think I can sell anything else. Yeah, I'm only gonna convert. I'm gonna leave... 2760 gold. Right, I forgot. I need to do it like this. 760. There we go. Nice and cool. Now, 352. What over in What still gives me over encumberment? Pondering, pondering. It's not the pouches, it's not the armor, it's not the drinks, it's not the food. It's definitely none of the books. So I assume it's bones and the soul gems, because soul gems tend to be pretty, uh, pretty rough on the backpack. Yeah, I will assume it's exactly that. Uh, what time it is? 3.52. So, we are still able to recast everything that we have. And get to Mortal in time, I hope. Uh, Riverside Lodge, yes. Mm-hmm. Muffle. Oh, wait. Okay, let's wait for Magicka, sure, no problem. Illusion! And now we are leveling up. Okay, let's see. Um, how are we going to do this? Because it was 114, so now 117 is a stamina level. Okay. And I, and I have so much health, but I'm still... Taking a lot of damage, despite the, despite that fact. So, yeah. Having a lot of health is definitely gonna be a thing. Um, I definitely have less stamina than Magicka for some reason. Oh, I know why. Um, because I have the Atronach Stone, and Atronach Stone gives a quite significant buff into Magicka, so... Yeah. Makes sense. Anyhow... Um, I wanted to cast you again. Got my bow activated, save before exiting this place, and to the mortal we go. Gonna drink some tea. That was like, um, officially that would be like a second dragon of the day, because one was at the tower, 
and the second one attack the city even though they shouldn't. Hence my surprise. Uh oh. Yeah, a little baby bandit. Don't have the black soul gems, but it doesn't matter. Gonna pick up you. Uh, those adventurers have died. Dang it. This is so sad. Need something? Yeah, I need you to find better friends. That's our king weapon, which I don't need. Steel grace that I'm gonna take though. Uh, let's go for the mill. I need to scrap a lot of bones. The bone meals eliminated. I'm also still going for the achievement uh, with harvesting butterflies. But I also believe it's a good time to use some sonic speed. So, why don't we do that? of energy. <clears throat> Speaking of enchanting, because I mentioned that before but I couldn't formulate my thought properly, uh, I was actually thinking about putting... Yeah, ghost snatches. They're just being summoned by um, the local adventurer and I think those are permanent summons because he always have them. They always have them, and they never disappear. Which is quite intriguing. It, it's definitely type of a summon that only works on the outside though, because Natchez would be too big to fit inside of the interior. But yeah, there's this perk. I'm gonna show you guys. It's an enchanting, which, well, I'm, I'm gonna grind to get uh, the 100. There's like no other way. Miracle. You can only pick this perk once per playthrough. Only once. You put your heart and soul into the next item you enchant at an arcane nexus, placing up to three enchantments upon that upon it that are 25% stronger. Try as you might, you will never able to be to be repeat this feat. Yep. Pretty much with this enchantment, I will be only able to place three enchantments once in the game in one item, make, making it an absolute piece that belongs in the museum. Oh shit, mages. That's gonna open dimension door. Uh, oopsie. 
Oopsie have been made. Your fire ain't shit. Bye. Yep, just... Just give me... Oh! Uh, that was my opportunity to fill the soul gem. And I don't have any more petties. Oh well. So it's only lessers and below. Uh, sorry, it's not lessers and below, it's lessers and higher level of souls. Ectoplasm. Save the game. That's a Skyrim save right there. Okay, for a second I thought I see a dragon, but no, it's butterflies. I'm gonna pick them up before I'm gonna get back to long stride. And just like that they disappeared. Of course they did. It has been some amount of time. I doubt that the be Ooh, that's a giant. Okay, let me just uh, avoid these guys. They're not causing any trouble and I don't want to have any trouble with them. The funny thing is, once the cow is going to get gifted to the giant from that guy, if we attack the giant, the cow becomes hostile towards us at the same time as well. And I can see that bandit camp is not didn't spawn back, so we are perfectly fine. It's a bandit chief. I guess Gang have decided to round up his buddy finally. I hear wolves, but they are behind the ridge and they are never gonna be a high level soul, so whatever. Whatever. Ooh, butterflies. All right, magic is back, so that means more long stride. I'm gonna try to eliminate the walking on water effect from Aquamarine that I have. It's a part of colorful magic, and I really like uh, the items like this that you only can get if you defeat a unique NPC, which apparently, according to the game, I already have defeated like two or three of them. Yeah, tomorrow for me to go this way. Oh dear, they're running from something. A uh, troll. That actually might give me the thing that I want, so I'm gonna cast it quickly. Yeah, this one might be less of a common. Common soul. That's good. Search, harvest, dispose. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, there's something walking on my screen. Hold up. A little bug. Where are those coming from? Well, never mind. Got rid of it. Um, so. I need to recast some abilities. Muffle and my Atronac can... Uh, is in serious need of a recast. So let's do that. Get back to long stride, wait for the energy to get back to its top shape. Unless the guys over here have spawned back, then we are not gonna do it. We're gonna. Yeah, they came back, but because all of them are humans, I'm gonna switch back to my regular weaponry, at least for now. The worst enemy over here. It's gonna be... Ah. 
The mage. It's always the mage. I kind of want to use the poisons, but no, I yeah. don't have any even. Oh my god, Pepega, aim. Yeah, I see the mage right there. And she's kind of my priority at this point. She yeah. escaped. She managed to heal herself too. God bless the bears are everywhere. <laughs> Good job, Mr. Yeah. Raider. You just killed yourself by jumping off the freaking bridge. You numpty. Kill the leader and oh. figure out who that is. <laughs> kill the leader, then figure out the rest. That's my boy. Yep, that's the first mage. Uh, I can only hope that this is the only guy that was here. Because he's technically the worst enemy in this entire place. Uh, yeah, Frost Breath activated. This is a surprise. Oh, God! Elixir, Spellbind, eh, Okay, I'm gonna pick them up. Sure, why not? There's never enough. I want to pick up your butt. Excuse me, I'm looting here. Rude, uncalled for, unnecessary. Victory's yours, I said you fucking better, man. Nah, oh, don't worry. My shout will kill you. Thought I heard some. Thought I heard something. Now it's your turn. A bad time to get lost, no, I didn't get lost. I I knew exactly where I'm going. Uh, that's a, just a bandolier. It's not the biggest bandolier. Let me take your ebony axe, though. In which play boots as well. Okay, one guy left, it's a boss. You're mine. Yeah. Oh yeah, I totally forgot about master. I totally forgot about master chest. That's it. That's your best. Orkish, don't need that. Gonna pick your armor. Oh, this time we have iron gauntlets. Okay, let's see. Cold of arms, ace of spiders. Wow, okay, I already can see that this is gonna be rich. Nordic bow. Pepper. Anybody likes peppers? This one is not even spicy. It's just green, so it means it's sweet. And sweet dreams are made of these. Yes, they are they are they are made out of peppers. And what did you need? Okay, I can take I can take this for a traveler. And who would have mind to disagree? And you can travel the world in the seven seas. And trust me, everybody is gonna look be looking for something.
Brad. Uh, where? Brad. Okay, so at least we know that the sweet spot is somewhere on the left side. Brad. Mom, spaghetti. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Ebony gold. I don't know what this is, but it looks nice. A crossword I can sell. Parker tusk hunting. No iron. The chest that was always open had more valuable stuff than the second bow, honestly. Dirge. Her dirge. Yeah, the first chest wa had more valuables. 100%. Yep, time to back to Longstride. At least for some time. Yeah, and the first quest I'm gonna try to do is the quest for the Alchemist. Whoa. Are those bandits? These guys look like bandits. Please. I'm warned. Please, you're my You lucky hit. And there, there goes, there goes the farmer. Real or ain't shit. Well, rip you. At least you had a jug of fresh milk. Three servings. Hog. Heavy lead? Nah. Viking double axe. I actually don't know what it gives, so I'm gonna take it. Because it's definitely a scrappable. 100%. Okay, uh, long stride. Oh, hello, Thalmer. Surprisingly, this time they're not even hostile against me. Let me guess, right next to that inn, there's gonna be another fight of Imperials versus Stormclog, because there always is one. Oh yeah, there it is. Well, ladies and gentlemen, place your bets. Imperials versus Stormcloaks. Who will win? Who will fail? Last time... Last time Stormcloaks have not only managed to kill all the Imperials, but they also eliminated the local Thalmor patrol. Hey, crazy. Well, I see already two Imperial soldiers not doing very well. Any yielders in the chat? Oh, there's seven over there. Uh, looks like bandits. One big battlefield here. Your belly like a Not much of a bandit after this one. Lockpick. 
10 nets back. Yeah, nothing of interest to me. Um, so we have two Imperials dead over here. But it also seems like I really believe that there's less Stormcloaks this time. Yeah, I really should, and I will, and I definitely will from the next time, from the next point on. Because this is the guaranteed place where the battles like this are happening. And yeah, it's uh, at this point it's pretty much decided, the Tells decided that Stormcloaks are going to die. Yep. Imperials won with a quite tremendous... With a quite tremendous lead of at least eight soldiers. You killed your shape of oh well, no 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 they have found something. I think they have found the straggler. The second wind. Jesus. They don't even care. They they just freaking went haywire on that. But I will agree. Um Predictions for every single Imperial battle that we're gonna notice is definitely gonna happen from this point on. I mean, I have a mod. I don't know if my mod can do a prediction. Uh, Thunder, if you are here, can you try to make a prediction in chat? Imperials win by 10 goals to 3. Uh, I would say that's a second win for the Empire in this zone. There's been word of some trouble nearby. Okay, I hear a dragon. I definitely hear a dragon. Hey Popo. I have definitely heard and I still hear him. That might be a dragon uh, either attacking or flying around. One of two. Gonna have my weapons ready for this. And I don't know what kind of type of dragon is that, so... Yeah. Mortal is right there. And see anything in the air. Anyway. Finally, we are entering the side quest part of the Morthal people. So, the first quest I want to do is the one for Alchemy Lady. Uh, how am I doing? Do you need any good. alchemy supplies? I'll do my best to provide them, assuming I haven't used them all up. I can only hope that you are doing also well, good or at least better. Jorgen and I both work hard all the time. Murthal is important to both of us. I bet it is. How long have you studied the alchemy? I picked up the trade when I was a girl. One of the temple healers staying here on a pilgrimage showed me the basics. She had a book with her, Song of the Alchemists, that I used to read over and over. I miss having a copy. I'll find a copy. If I'll find a copy, I'll bring it to you. Really? I'd be happy to show you a bit about herbs if you find the book. Okay, um, Until next time. quest accepted. Let's go and do yes. it. Whenever that the book might be. You're okay today? That's good to hear. Let's just hope it's gonna be like that uh, for as long as possible. Hey, take a look at that. We are actually gonna have to get back to Dragon's Bridge, kinda pass through Solitude and get to uh, get over here. Or is it inside of a Solitude? We're gonna have to go to Solitude? Really? We're gonna have to steal that book. We're gonna go syst first system of a down album called Steal This Album. Um, yeah, we, we're definitely gonna go like that. <laughs> I think I'm about to steal. <laughs> yeah, even better from the Bard's College. Oh my god. What could possibly go I mean, I have invisibility, I have the muffle. Why do I worry? Why do I care? It's not that far anyway. Well... I'm gonna save the game. Because it's time for a sonic speed. I think 
think I'm about to steal. Stories, Bob and Chloe. Oh, shit. You don't know your name. I'm gonna call you Timmy. Thanks for the follow, Timmy. <laughs> well, there goes the energy. Fight. You bested me. Uh, no, not so epic fight. Please have a steel crossbow on you. you. Uh, no. Any true sons and daughters of Skyrim, tell them to head to the window. I know that crossbow can drop like as a clear weapon inside of a chest, and it also can drop from guards, most likely from guards. And I'm kind of hoping that every single time I see an Imperial soldier, every single time I see a dead guard, he's gonna have a crossbow and I'm gonna be super happy. But the game is like, nope. be able to um, yeah we're gonna have to observe the execution sadly but that also means we're gonna have to kind of I wonder if in special edition you can steal the uh, necklace of Talos because the necklace of Talos is actually useful for the quest that I'm gonna do much much later in the future who are these guys these guys look like somebody like people who need some gold there are dragons about traveler I was at hell again. Give the gold. Thank you, traveler. Be safe, and don't forget to keep an eye on the sky. Okay, solitude, solitude, it's solitude. I guess this way. Yeah, it's this way. Yeah, I'm going to need to uh, ex discover the Catless Farm anyway as well. If you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak. yes, joining the Legion. I'm still considering. I'm still considering to ignore the Civil War, Civil War part of the game, because I genuinely don't want to do it. It's just, it's just bad. Oh yes, Position. they can and they will. Just Sorry, watch. You need to go home. Go home and stay there until your mother comes. Lock the city gate. Get on with it. You betrayed us. You should tell her that her uncle war. is scum. No one wants to hear his high king. About Best she know now, Advar. You're all heart. Baby. Traitor. Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Torig. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't Traitor. deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric story. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such is our way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords. Nope, there is no way to save him. The only thing that you can do is that you can get his amulet, Very which way, is Rock actually here. needed. Bow your head. This day, I go to Sarmengard. 
This person is busy. Yep. If we're not gonna loot this uh, this amulet right now, later it's not gonna be able. You are. We are not gonna be able to get it. <laughs> that person is busy dying. It seems. Okay, uh, Bard's College. Let's just do it quickly and try not to get captured. Some gate guard you were. Wah, 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 wah. Welcome to Bard's College. Population. Book that I need Welcome to forget. Oh shit. College. I'm the headmaster. No, here. you cannot help. I'm um, I you cannot help me. Yes. I'm not here. Speed you along. I'm not here. I am absolutely not here. I'm not a person that wants to steal your books. Yeah, I'm not casting this invisibility spell at all. Yep. Bye. Welcome to Solitude, nope. home of the arts here in Skyrim. Bye. I'm leaving. I feel chilly. 729. Um, I'm gonna have to buy a bed in Morthal. For a second, I thought he's not gonna be. Able, I am not gonna be able to like cancel the conversation with that guy. I was like, okay, I'm forced to do the side quest now. Re. <laughs> okay, let me recast my thing. Okay, get the long stride ready. I'm gonna wait for the energy to regenerate. Save the game because we've managed to do a successful infiltration per se and it's sonic speed time Nobody witnessed anything. Out of energy. I know it's kind of mean to like stop the song like in such a key moment, but <laughs> I simply have no mana. I simply have no energy to cast it. For the entire duration. This is why I was thinking about applying three enchantments into my helmet instead of uh, applying into my chest. Which, honestly, I don't think it's actually gonna make any difference. I mean, I could apply it into the chest because chest piece can still handle um, health regeneration, conjuration, and alteration. While my helmet could handle uh, conjuration and restoration. Two things at the same time. That would reduce the cost of the conjuration spells by like, quite a bit. Which actually is something that I'm aiming for, considering I'm constantly using conjur- Oh shit! <laughs> This what you Cool down finished. Um actually I'm gonna be a good man. Morthal used to be a quiet place. 
I'm gonna heal him. But then, the world used to be different. War never changes. Yes, I want to cause a significant earthquake with my head. Because of the center of gravity, it's gonna get shifted from my body into my head, and every time I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna make a shockwave so big, even dragons are gonna be like, nah, I ain't fucking with that. It is a tactical movement. And I'm pretty sure that it is going to work. There's not really a lot of side quests for this for Marthol, isn't there? Because this is the one of the side quests. The other one is that burn house quest, which I can pretty much finish right now without even going to sleep. That will be two out of three. But what else there is to do in this place? The guy that we just saved, he can challenge us to a fist fight, but I'm I'm too weak. At this point, there's no way I can win that fight in any way, shape, or form. Jorgen and I both work hard all the time. Murthal is important. I found to both a book. Ah, oh, it's amazing how much you can learn from a book. Here, let me show you some of the things the temple healers taught me about potions. Hey, alchemy increase to thirteen. All right then. She can even train me into alchemy, but uh. Yeah. That's a different story. I think in the morning I can sell some firewood to one of the guys over here. That would be two out of three. And then I could finish up this place by yes. doing the quest here with the vampires and whatnot. With the burned house. Yeah, let's do that. And that's all the firewood that I need. Only 10. I am freezing. Um, I think I should go to the inn and ask about local rumors. Maybe that's gonna give me uh, some kind of information. Ah, yes, finally. Someone comes in. You want something to drink? Nothing but time these days. There ain't much to offer, but if you want a place dry to spend um, the night, I'll rent you a room. Okay, any rumors floating around? Here, take a look at this. Stay clear of Marsh. Um, I need... To... Where can I learn more about magic? Is there a story behind that burned down house? Rogar's house? It burned down not too long ago. It's a real pity about his wife and kid. The screams woke half the town. Most folk won't go near it now for fear it's cursed. How did the fire start? Hrogar claims it was a hearth fire. Some folks say Hrogar started it himself. Wow, that's a rough accusation. Uh, with, with his own wife and child inside. That's what they say. See, he's living with Alva now. That started the day after the fire. It ain't right moving in with a new love the day after your kin die like that. Oh, okay, so the so it's not right for him to move one day after, assuming that he found a new lover. So it would be okay for him to be homeless and sleep on the street. Nice logic. And of course, they can't prove he murdered them. Aye. Our Jarl would sure like to know if he did, though. Might even pay to find out. Okay, any new rumors that floats around? Here. Take a look at this. It's another letter. Activity, never the stone hills. Uh, looking for work. Any rumors? 
Big talk of a little boy in Windhelm named yeah, the that's Ventus a Ventus Arachino. That's a, that's a Dark this. Brotherhood. He's been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. That's a that's a that's a Dark Brotherhood stuff. We're gonna do that sometime in the future, not right now. Um, any business in Motho Slow? Looking for yeah, she doesn't have anything good to talk with us oh. about. Let me check those notes. That's a manor. Expo Dashpool Velos. Yeah, I already did that. Fuck that place. Then. Uh, Hunter Note Karas Eggs. Yeah, whatever. That's a Cancelmo. I don't need that. Let's take care of the marsh. Investigate the sources of noises in the marsh. Stench activity near Stone Hills. Yep, all the maps updated. Um, let me check the quest lines. Ra late to rest. This is a quest that I can do right now. Oh, I actually can't. Because the Yara's already asleep. And when I'm gonna try to enter, she's gonna be like, Hey, well, you're waking me up. Get the fuck out. So um, the thing I can do... Folian had his work to keep him busy. ...is I can buy a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. No, you won't, because I already know where the room is. And we're gonna sleep for 12 hours. And then we're gonna go to the Jarl. Gonna have to only recast a few spells. The Muffle and the Atronach. See ya. <clears throat> Hungry and thirsty, you say? Let me know if there's anything else you need. Hmm? Uh, yeah, the quest is already marked for me. If you've business with the Jarl, I'd ask that you speak to me first. Nah, I'm just gonna go directly to the Jarl. Fuck the your Legion's privacy. Looking... <laughs> I do what I can to see that Idgrud's time isn't wasted. That she only has to deal with an excellent. So, you've done us a life has brought you to Morthal and to me. What purpose this serves, we will no doubt see. Welcome. Nice rhymes. Um. You stand on the war? Is there some kind of trouble? I hear you want someone to look into that house that was on fire. Grogar's house fire? Well, he lost his wife and daughter in the blaze. My people believe it to be cursed now. Who am I to gainsay them? Uh, what does Grogar say happened? Grogar blames his wife for spilling bear fat in the fire. Many folk think he set the fire himself. Why would he do that to his own family? Lust can make a man do the unthinkable. The ashes were still warm when he pledged himself to Alpha. Simp! Uh, so why haven't you arrested him? On rumor and gossip? No. But you, a stranger, might find the truth for us. Sift through the ashes that others are too fearful to touch. See what they tell you. Should you prove him guilty or innocent, I will reward you. Yeah, Horton Jail. <laughs> I actually I actually have that sound effect always ready <laughs> on my keyboard, so yeah. Uh, I can definitely hear a drag I don't know if that dragon's gonna like approach over here. Yeah, he's flying over there. He's not gonna fly anywhere else, I hope. You wanna play a game? You wanna play a game? Yeah, who are you? Helgi. The father says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Are you a stranger? No, I'm a friend. Do you know what happened to your house? The smoke woke me up. I was hot and I was scared. So I hid. Then it got cold and dark. I'm not scared anymore. But I'm lonely. Will you play with me? Um, if I do, will you tell me who set the fire? Okay, let's play hide and seek. You find me, and I'll tell you. We have to wait for nighttime, though. The other one is playing too, and she can't come out until then. Somebody else? The other one? Uh, what do you mean by that? I can't tell you. She might hear me. 
She's so close. If you can find me first, I can tell you. Fine. Find the Helgi after dark, which I will. Um, where is the person that's responsible for buying wood from this place? There should be a guy or two. Yeah, I think it's him. It might be him. Keep your wits about you. Morthal's hardly a safe place. Uh, no. Let's just buy some lumber. Good luck to you. Uh, was you that work. you, Kroger? Can I help you? Fire. I have firewood to sell. Honest gold for honest work. There we go. That's that's uh, that's uh, that's that's considered as a help in the city. So that's two out of three. Um. Yeah, so now I am pretty much forced to get into the into an inn and wait for 11 hours, I think. I'm gonna run out of divine armor. Gonna have to recast it. Yes, yeah, stay a while and listen. Uh, 9 a.m. So that's gonna be... 9 p.m. 10 11 14 hours of waiting because there's sadly there's nothing else to do in this town We are changing the name from Morthol to Simthol. Yes From this point on this is a Simthol. I cannot even pronounce it properly. It's it's that stupid uh, <coughs> What can I do? Hungry and thirsty the Your friend. Yarl. I'd ask that you speak to me um, first. Um, yeah, I need to recast my what is it? armor, and now I can go and talk to uh, the kid at night. And I know where she I still remember how to complete this quest. Thankfully, there is a graveyard somewhere. Yeah, it's right here. I think I should save the game first. Yeah, I might have screwed up a little bit. Never should have come here. <laughs> Rip. You found me. Laylot was trying to find me too, but I'm glad you found me first. Laylot was told to burn mommy and me, but he didn't want to. I've studied the masters, he wanted to play from with the writers of the poetic and ever. Edda, to the minstrels of the oak. He kissed me on the neck, no and I got so cold that the fire didn't even hurt. She's dead. He's mere fear. Leila thought she could she's, take me and keep she's me. She's a vampire! But she can't. I'm all burned up. I'm tired. I'm gonna sleep for a while now. Rest in peace, child. They say wood elves learn Rest to climb trees before they crawl Leilet. and jump. She's walk. dead. He's mere fear. Skyrim is a foreign she's, land. She's a vampire! Can I help you? <laughs> um, <clears throat> what can you tell me about your wife? Leolette, I thought she left to join the Stormcloaks. Oh, my poor Leolette. Did you notice anything strange before she left? She began to spend a lot of time with Alva. Yet just a week before, she despised her. In fact, the night she disappeared, she was supposed to meet Alva. Alva told me later that she never showed up. I never got to tell her goodbye. I think they may have met... I think they may have met after all. You think Alva? But that means... Ye gods, you think Alva is a vampire? Well, how do you explain other things it's it's a possibility we cannot ignore you know that no you're wrong you must be wrong Leolette may have met her fate out in the marsh I refuse to believe Alva had anything to do with this there is no way you can prove it to the Jarl well, unless I'm unless I'm gonna investigate her house I'll be right here then. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I guess yeah. I'm gonna be here then. Um, I'm gonna investi investigate her house during the day. 
Because if I'm gonna do it, do it during the night, um, one of the NPCs is gonna get hostile against me. And I don't want any hostile NPCs. Uh, room. Sure thing. It's yours. I'll show you to your room. You don't have to. Gonna sleep like a baby for nine hours. Hey, you just killed my wife that turned out to be a vampire. So, uh, <coughs> ever heard about wood? <laughs> Let me know. <laughs> Anything else you need? Oh <laughs> my God! Greetings. Greetings. Okay, I need to get invisibility mm -hmm. again. Oh, Alva is outside. Hey, Alva. I'm totally not planning to like. I hear you put me in that yeah, I totally don't plan to get into your house and steal your shit. Uh, I need to get invisibility as a favorite. Ooh, even my followers are getting invisible. That's good. Okay. Bruh. Oh, Jesus Christ. There we go. Nice. Undetected. Hmm? Hmm? Oh, hello there. I'm gonna try to do this as sneakily as possible. Without him going hostile, because that's quite important. Elvis Journal. The journalist says, I'm a fucking vampire. I, I, I'm also might suck everybody here for two, three subs or prime subs from Amazon. Yes, that's Alva. She's basically... She's basically that. Can I just politely leave the house? Yeah, you didn't notice a damn thing. I'm totally not here. Sneak in Greece. Bye. Yep, nobody noticed a damn thing. Uh there you are. Never should have. There you are. Uh who are they firing at? Well, you have a crossbow, so I'm kinda wish you die. Yep, Elva's a coffin, bathtub streamer, and now she's running the fuck away. <laughs> Elva is now running away like a little bit she is. <laughs> Coffin backed up streamer. <laughs> That's a good one. That's actually a good one. Is Grogar innocent or not? Elva set the fire, and she's the murderer. I have the proof. Oh. I think she had it in. Actually, she's a vampire. She planned to enslave the whole town so they can give her primes in tier threes and all the 200 donos so they can only hear her speaking their names because desperation. I assume you have proof? Can't go making accusations like that without proof. Yes, I have the entire list of simps right there. So it's true. It is. Traitorous <laughs> bitch. Morthal owes you a debt. Here. You were promised a reward for solving the crime, but I need one more favor from you. Morthal is still in danger. The journal mentions Movarth, a master vampire I thought was destroyed a century ago. I'll gather together some able-bodied warriors to clean out Movarth's lair. They'll be waiting outside for you to lead them. Yes, Jarl Ingrid had a very profitable cooking stream until Alvas had just stepped in and stole every single viewer from her. All right, so every single able body warrior. You business with the Yarl. Let's I let's do this quest. First. Whoa. I do what I can to see that Idgrud's time isn't wasted. Hold up. And that she chill. Only has to just chill. Come on. Deal with. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Uh, kill, kill him. Yes. Him. Let's uh, let's let's do that. Uh, what about eyes on the hunt? Wait, I think we need to wait for this guy till he's gonna talk to us. 
And then we're gonna have to talk with him for the you second may not time. Notice, but I've died once before. A priest of RK pronounced me dead and bid my soul goodbye. But a part of me was still tethered to an animal, and by some miracle, it was his soul that RK claimed instead. Pog. She's dead. Layalette is dead. Sag. <laughs> I'd like to buy some lumber. Doing some building, eh? <laughs> we can deliver it yes. wherever you need. <laughs> you want to help me kill the vampire, right? I want vengeance for my wife. Vengeance for Laylet. We're marching on Movar's lair, whether you come with us or not. What yep. Else living near a sawmill? He is pretty I slow. Just see Yifri shaking your head in shame. Well. <sighs> uh, okay, let's go for that cave. Let's just complete this quest, man. It's hilarious. And I'm afraid that I might actually not have enough gold for completing this quest. Then again, we, we will see. If I'm gonna get 750 gold, I will be able to buy a house and I will be able to decorate it. I mean, I already have built house once, so I could even do it off stream. I could do it on stream if I'm gonna have enough time. And the monies, but we're gonna see. But after that, I'm pretty sure I will be able to consider Morthol stage of her fire DLC to be done and we will be able to move towards Dawnstar. Besides all the usual culprits. Yeah. Death and vampires. That's what's and inside. Vampires? Cowards. We must kill the vampires. Are we heading out? We have to make them pay. Of course. But why not let her go in first? Are we heading out? We will, in a moment. I'm just a poor man trying to make a living. I'd leave Mortal were it in my power. Uh... I have to go to the vampire lair alone? They may be cowards, but I'm not. I'll go with you. Um, you're a brave man. I think it would be better if you waited here. I suppose you're right. I'm not a fighting man. Go and avenge my Laylet for me. Fort Tuchanka. Yes, let's go. Fort Tuchanka. Uh, let's see. My divine oh, armor is gonna expire soon. This damn war has cost us. Um, we gotta fight against vampires. Vampires susceptible to fire. Let me get my flame matronac. E everything. Yeah, grinding like the entire Hellfire DLC is a grind fest. This is why I don't like it. Because you cannot enjoy it because three quarters of the content of her fire is grind. Let me mind you, grind in a single player game. Um, I don't have any black soul gems, so I technically could go with my regular equipment before I'm gonna enter, so yeah, let's do that. Let's kill some vampires. This is why I have a mod that basically gives me all the resources that I want for the Hairfire houses. I, 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 cannot, I cannot screw with that DLC. It's my least favorite DLC that I can get. Ooh, that's a frostbite spider. Um... I know I can get it soul. At least the lesser one. Yeah, and I also should make an interior cell here. And we got a regular human being over here, so let's go. Hello, would you like to talk about Jesus Christ? I right, take it as a no. Let me 
Just take this coin purse off. Huh? Huh? Nani? If I'm gonna go that way, that's gonna get me to directly to the vampire, so I guess I have no other choice anyway. Let me check if I have any diseases on my character. Orc race, yeah, we are good for now. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. I'm gonna go for this ore. There we go. Uh, another vampire in sight. What was that? That's a Morvarth. Yeah, he needs to go down first. Uh, I'm almost dead. Jesus Christ. One dead. Crap, crap, crap. Cold damage. That's the best you can do. Okay. Okay, that's them. Atronach. Alright, that could go better. But we didn't die, so I'm happy about that. I'm definitely infected with the sanguine vampires, but I'm okay with that. I have a bunch of potion of cures disease, so I technically do not care, but I don't know where the bodies are, so candlelight. Mortify Piquin. Mm-hmm. We stopped. What is it? Okay, so that's one corpse. That's a second corpse. Death Guard. That actually might be useful for my later character. Yeah, that was a close one. Vampires are actually quite dangerous. Depending on their level, of course, but still. Uh, that's a large bandolier. I'm gonna take it. And it's still not the end. Because there are uh, pretty much uh, chest rewards. I think one chest... Uh, there's a chest reward inside over there, but there's also... A little bit of vampire situation a little bit deeper inside of this place yeah there's an archer over there Yo. no you ain't Yeah, and this gets me to the exit, so now I can visit the other side. Yeah, that was a close fight. Honestly, I would be I was okay with uh, a vision of me dying. I was totally okay. 
I would deserve that because I rushed too much. I did not focus on the single target. I simply went from target to target, jumping all the time. That was that was not that was just not good. So if I would die here, uh, I would accept it. Oh hi, Alva. Bitch. And if I'm, if I recall correctly, oh, illusion to 91, nice. If I recall correctly, yeah, Morvat's boots. Uh, those boots I'm gonna keep because they uh, might belong in the museum later, unironically. Okay, let's go for the chest. After I'm gonna be sure that this entire place is clean. Which it is. I'm gonna check if I have Sanguine Vampires. Or Grace. Well. After all of this, it seems like I did not caught the Sanguine Vampires at all. But I think considering I have 13 Cure Disease Potions, might as well take one. Because who knows, maybe that effect is just invisible for now, I don't know. Um, anyway. Time to see what's in the chest. Excuse me. <clears throat> Card of Demons, Circular Alteration, Bows, Crossbow that I cannot use because it's enchanted, uh, some jewelry, uh, Red God Cape, Red God Armor. The entire Red God Armor is here. Nice. Stalker Armor. Ooh, Robes of Conjuration. That's a vampire robes. If, honestly, I was play as a. As a bread and spell sword, I would use an armor like this, 100% of the time. I would basically craft myself a vampire armor that has no enchantments, and I would just put my, my own enchantments into it. But, at least I can sell this. Okay, let's get out of here, let's report the success of this mission to the Jarl. Possibly we're gonna get some gold. And we're possibly gonna get some rare items, uh, because when you become a Jarl, not Jarl, when you, go, when you become- oh, Elgi's ghost? Mother's calling me. It's time for me to sleep now. I'm so tired. Thank you for making her feel better. Oh, and that was cute. That was just cute. Uh, you can keep the Alpha alive in this quest. Uh, yeah, because she's considering she's running away. Yes, you can. But why would you why would you keep her? Why would you keep that foul heathen alive? <sighs> Besides, she's a bloodbath streamer, so I think it will be against the TOS. Another quiet day. Oh, uh, I got just got given four letters by one of my companions. That spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. Well, look at you. If only everyone acted like you did. Pog, the Master Vampire Morvas is dead. By the eight, I didn't think he could do it. Now maybe we can put all this behind us. Take this as a token of our gratitude. Money? Okay, I can buy. I can buy the house with this money. Good. Anything else you need, my Jarl? There is room in my court for a new thing. It's an honorary title mainly, but there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my homeland. You help my people, and I'll make you my thing. 
Uh, that will be an honor. Good luck. Three out of three? Two out of three? Uh, is there some kind of trouble in Mortal then? That which is unknown can create unease, even fear. It is to be expected. Two out of three. Some fear our new resident wizard. As they grow to know him, they will accept him. Time will prove me right. Okay, so I All sold right, the wood. <laughs> hmm. She. Oh, is there something I can help you with? Uh, what's wrong with Yorick? My brother is sensitive. He I think Ingrid wanted to like things. get some death we bells. We were taking him to the temple of Kinnereth in Whiterun, just so the healers could make sure he was in good health. And they say he's fine. Are you heading to Whiterun? Could you take this letter to the priestess, Danica Pure Spring? Oh boy. It's a note about Yorick's health. Yep, I guess that's the only quest that I didn't done. I thought there was something from the inside. I thought that chopping wood and selling it counts as helping into this town. But I guess I have to. Gonna, I'm gonna have to do this. Thank you. Good luck to you. <sighs> okay. Good to see you. Hey, good to see you too. Finally, a guard that actually likes Everything's me. Everything's in order. Yeah, I bet. Oh, looks like somebody's using fast traveling. What did you need? No, it's not. I, I'm not really sad. It's just a little. Te it's just the tedium of going to White Run and delivering the letter, which is something I don't really want to do. Good job out there. Thankfully, the road from uh, here. To white run should be at this point clean. At least I hope it's gonna be. Okay, for a second, for a second, I thought dimension door. Mm, mm. Yeah, I could do that because it's just get gonna get me directly. But then again, it's gonna be a fast travel, and we're gonna have to finish that tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Deliveries are your job, courier. Yeah. Courier six. What did you you delivered a missile into my home. How could you? Songs can be an important tool of political dissent. Some even say. Yeah, I'm not even gonna sort my inventory, at least not right now, I just want to deliver the letter. Because we're gonna get back home and sort our inventory after I'm gonna make sure that the letter is gonna get into the right place. But yeah, using the dimension door here was actually a good idea. It's definitely gonna shorten my time without using fast travel. And I think I have a couple bones, so I'm gonna try to scrap them at the mill. What time it is? 11 a.m. Good. We're gonna have to do a long road from my house to Morthal anyway, so it's like... Uh, there's nothing I can do about that, sadly. I love piggies. Piggies, despite the fact that they are quite noisy creatures, they're actually very smart and very clean. Yeah, I don't care about the uh, candlelight and my Atronach because I don't think we're gonna enter any fight anytime soon unless there's suddenly there's gonna be a dragon attack. Which I also think I doubt that's gonna happen, considering we already have killed two dragons today. If not three. <sighs> oh, 
Let's visit oh, Bellathorn. Uh, I should also mark the quest. Assist people, deliver the letter, and Danica is somewhere over there. I'd even buy one of your relatives if you... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Yep, yeah, bit of this and bit of that. Let's see what I can sell. Uh, harvesting hammer. Uh, dwarven sword that's gonna be... Yeah, and you want to sell this. Orcish of Gathering. Electro thingies. Thingy me jiggies. What else? Uh, that's a minor alteration, so I can get rid of that. Ebony of Regeneration. Um, mm -hmm -hmm. More vest boots, that's, uh, that's unique, so we're gonna keep it. This can go... Red Spindle stays, that's replenishing magical regeneration, waning magic, magical resistance. But it's a week, so I'm not even gonna keep it or think about it. Those scrolls can go to hell. Aquamarine, that's actually... Yeah, I'm gonna sell this. This card. This card, because I have a duplicate. Already 6,000 gold, which is already good enough. Cave, that's flawless diamond, which I'm not gonna sell. Green tourmaline. Tourmaline. That's actually gonna stay. Painting. Rough stuff can stay for bed. I mean, for later, because I can convert that uh, into actual gem. Do come back. A fine day to you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hands. You come back. I have delivery from Ingrid. Yorick's sister? Poor child. Magic runs deep in that family's bloodline. It's not always a blessing. Thank you for this. Something for your trouble. Gold. 750. Grace of Kinnereth be with you. Yay, money. Now I can buy the house, but... We are not gonna do it today. We're gonna buy that house tomorrow. Because it's already five and a half hours and I still need to get to the gym. I still need to eat something. And the earlier I'm gonna go to the gym, the better actually. Because then I will have more time for myself. I'm gonna have to um, only sell the bot so he can release a new short that I'm gonna upload after the stream because I have decided that every single day um, because of the new year I'm gonna every single day I'm gonna upload a one short clip from my stream I can't not tonight I need to go home I swear my father is starting to suspect something <laughs> how are you doing the hounds Andy's tape you know you know he can do that you know we can ex you know we can exchange that You know what can happen. Oh no, it's Javier, only adventure leader. Lead. Yeah, adventure leader is not even like doing anything. He's not even mourning the loss of his friends. What a guy. What a guy. So, you wanna explain what you sided with those boogeymen? <laughs> uh. Alright, but this is, uh, this is what I'm gonna call it a day. Let me save the game. This time, because, yeah, I just want to get to the gym a little bit earlier today. What have we have done today? We have done everything that is, was to do in Mortal, and we killed a couple dragons, and we have done another exploration, which makes me happy. Let's see who is online right now today. Appreciate it, Red. 
Thanks for stop. Thanks for stopping by. Um, I spy with my little eye. I see Silly Cat. She's playing Fallout 4, and I did not have a chance of raiding her, like in forever. So might as well raid her right now. Hold up, I have a caps lock. Silly Cat Man is playing Fallout 4, just doing her thing. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you today that have stopped by my channel. Links to my YouTube, Discord, uh, Twitter, whatever you guys need are down below. Thanks for all the follows, thanks for everybody who was chatting, thank you for everybody who was lurking. And yeah. I'll be back with Skyrim. I already have placed a new schedule for this month, so check my Discord for it. Hope you guys are gonna have a good rest of the Tuesday. And yeah, see you guys tomorrow. See ya.